Today I want to talk about discipline. I want to talk about passion. I want to talk about motivation. I want to talk about what we can do for ourselves, by ourselves, within ourselves. I want to talk about that. I want to rant about it. I want to see where my mind goes because I understand it. Because I've been on both sides, the darkness and the light. I've been there. I've been a fatso, a drug addict, an alcoholic, a womanizer, a procrastinator, a lost man with a lost soul. I've been there. Overeating, over drinking, feeling pity for myself, thinking the worst thoughts, saying I was unlucky, saying things weren't fair. In some cases, I'm in that same place now. Sometimes I relapse in a mental way because I've changed my habits. I've changed my life around. I found the discipline. I found the motivation. I found what I needed to find within me to succeed and to pursue a better life, to become a better man. Some of you will achieve this level way younger than me. Some of you at the same height of life that I achieved it. Some of you will achieve it way later. But regardless of where you are, where you are on your path on that journey, the main thing we have to keep in our minds is we cannot quit trying. We cannot quit trying when we feel bad. We cannot quit trying when we fuck up, when we screw up, when we go back, when we relapse. We can't quit trying to do the right thing. We can't lie to ourselves and say, this is it. I won't be able to do it. Because that only becomes true if you quit trying to do the right thing. Perseverance is a word that I love. You have to persevere. And in order to persevere, you have to fail. Otherwise, you won't have the opportunity to persevere. You understand? Perseverance only, comes, only becomes real uh, when you fall, when you make a mistake, when you uh, fail at what you persevere in. We have to understand that motivation is nothing. Motivation is an emotion, it's a feeling, it's fleeting. What is motivation? Motivation is like uh, something that happens and we can't control it. Motivation is something that gets triggered by outside sources most of the time, by other people, by other situations, by external circumstances. Motivation can be used when it's there. Motivation isn't always there, is it? How many times do you feel unmotivated? And how many times do you, do you use that unmotivation, that lack of motivation, to not do something? You blame everything on, I'm not motivated. I don't know what to do. And in some ways, I'm there right now with you. Sometimes I feel lost. We gotta do something. Motivation cannot be the fuel that we use to go ahead and try things or to go do what we know we have to do today. And so that's why motivation fails everybody. Everybody's looking for something that doesn't work. It's like putting orange juice in your car to, to, to run it. It won't work. That's motivation. What we need is unwithering discipline. We need to be tough, mentally tough. We need to understand and believe that discipline is the fuel, is the vehicle that's going to drive us, going to get us to where we want to be. And discipline makes you work hard because you know you have to. It doesn't matter what you feel. It doesn't matter what you think. It doesn't matter what's happening before, right now, or what will happen tomorrow. The one thing you know for sure is that through the discipline, through that muscle, through that conviction, through that relentlessness, you will be disciplined and you will do what you have to do. There is no doubt in discipline. 
There is no questions in discipline. There is no, there is no insecurity in discipline. The discipline is the mother of everything. The mother of all skills, values, virtues is discipline. And to be disciplined, you must be self-aware, patient, understanding, flexible with yourself emotionally, psychologically. But you must be tough. You must be rough. You must be strong to be disciplined. You must build those. The one thing we should all be striving for, all should be working towards, is a better, more disciplined version of ourselves. A better, more disciplined version of ourselves. Tomorrow, the goal is to be more, to be a better and more disciplined version than what I am, I am today. And the day after tomorrow, a more and better, and a, a better disciplined, a better version and more disciplined than I was the day before. That's the only goal. Nothing will save you. Nothing will help you more than building discipline. That's God. God is discipline. Discipline. The beautiful thing about it is that you can only get more disciplined. And once you start feeling the benefits of discipline, creativity flows, your body's synchronized, your energy is crazy in a good way. Nothing will set you free faster, nothing will take you further, quicker, nothing will make you more resilient than a disciplined mind, a disciplined body, and a disciplined soul.